Good morning, everyone. Happy New Day week and special thanks for attending today's service. Welcome to our monthly service for February 2019. I hope you are all in good health and excellent speed. As I said in my sermon, followed our New Year's Day ceremony, 2019 is a very commemorative year. Here in Chicago, we have the 10th anniversary ceremony on November 3rd. Konkokyo will celebrate the 150th anniversary of the Divine Call from October to November, which is especially meaningful on November 15th for us, because we believe that from North America will enjoy a pilgrimage to home. That is the exact day our founder received the Divine Call 160 years ago. Additionally, the Concord Church Virus will celebrate the scientific memorial anniversary of the Reverend So Chou's our mentor, on November 29. I now have a great enthusiasm to participate to develop peace and joy in my heart toward an unbreakable one throughout this year. I prostrate myself before Kani and pray to Tenji Kano Kami through not only the divine virtue and mediation of Reverend Sochi Ospo, but of our founder divine virtue and mediation as a following. Like Reverend Osbana, our founder, who always respected each and everything which happened as Kami's sacred working, meaning thankful, brightly, and with a divine grace, no matter what happened in each day, second of daily life. I seek to be like this to please be developed so that peace and joy in my heart is unbreakable always. With the attitude of heart, please help me to become of great service to open this precious way of the Concord face to find the true peace and human happiness. We decide. I, I have really hoped each of you join me in coming to wish for, for the Concordia of Chicago to be fulfilled. After New Year's Day ceremony, I asked each attendee to randomly pick a teaching of a founder or a one from the teaching of the Amaran Soji Ozubo. I pray asking Kami to give each of us the teaching that Kami most wanted us to think about and put into practice for this year. When I found the teaching each person picked, I was amazed with the fact that each person picked the most suitable one for him or her. The teaching I picked was, true faith is to receive the greatest blessing of each. After the World War II, Reverend Sojo Tsubo realized he had participated in the long way and had a honey desire to participate in all seriousness and have true faith. He has sought coming to wish with all his heart since then. His way of passing demi faith would be described as follows seeking honestly for the heart of the universe, if there is a way. Left it to my heart, since spirit of the great universe. Seeking honestly for the heart of the universe, if there is a way, left it to my heart, spirit of the great universe. The more he participated in this way, the more he could communicate with Kami. Kami led him to deepen his faith, to reveal the essence of our founder's faith. He talked about our founder faced everywhere whenever he was asked. One day he was asked to lead the faith meeting at the Kogas. He talked about our faith throughout the night. The next morning, Mrs. Koga showed him a folding fan, saying that this is a treasure of Kogas. Inside it, there were small Japanese characters that were written by the third successor of our founder, Sandai Kobuko-sama. 
It was written a true faith. Makoto no Shinji in Japanese. Holding that fan, Devan Otsubo prayed to Kami, asking what was true faith. Then he received the following revelation through the voice of Sandai Konko sama. True faith is to receive the greatest blessing of ease. Makoto no Shinji wa toa. Anshi no omikayo ika itada koto de arimasu. I made 80 pieces of paper, which included one sheet in each paper for each one of us to pick for this year. Each sheeting was different. This time I fold, folded each paper, especially distinguishing the meaning of each sheeting. The sheeting that impressed me the most at that time was as follows. I am a happy man, simple and innocent. I am a man that can but tr put trust in the benevolence of the universe. This teaching showed the most important attitude in order to completely respect each and every happening as Kami is sacredly doing with gratitude whatever happens and no matter what, how difficult it might be. When I accomplish my faith practice in this way, my heart will never be broken. I will receive the greatest blessing of ease and deepen my unbreakable, peaceful, and joyful heart no matter what happens in my life. With peace and joy in my heart, I will definitely be able to open this true way of Konko. This year, I hope, Kami's wish for the divine call will be revealed to the world.